Hello gamers and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Stellaris with <coughs> the Rokari Empire. Exciting things have happened, I've got two vassals. Um, also, I've started building a ring world here. Because I want to learn more about mega structures also. I do have quite a few habitats by now. Habitats are basically uh, space stations that circle a planet and um, <clears throat> have very decent opportunities. You can create some unity here. Uh, also, society research, arguably, they are not as good as um, planets uh, because they are only 12 tiles. Also, they uh, um, count as a planet and or as a colony depending here they count as a planet for the research and they do count as a um, as a uh, colony for the uh, tradition so it's not like you can pl use them for playing tall with a minimized amount of systems yes maybe you can do that So, <clears throat> research is going nicely. I've got quite a few species as well in the Empire already. The Euthonian, Synthetics, um, Magdpux, uh, Hifna, Dokari and luckily also Pikachu. They all have full citizenship but them, which is causing problems. I would like to give them full citizenship. Trade deal duration expired. The research agreement. Hifna. Unreadable string. Good for him. He's a Roma. What's that? Hifna assembly. Survey speed plus 25%. Okay, that's the Hifna. They are also in the Federation. Offer trade deal. Yeah, I think it's beneficial still. Maybe you can give me some credits. Yeah, you can. Let's do that for 15 years. The habitats are nearly full. So Pikachu really likes the habitats. He has a Pikachu as well. And um, it's like an... How's it called? The Expanse. The Netflix TV series. He has another Pikachu. One will appear. He has no Pikachu yet. Oh, there's a trade deal offer. They've accepted. Good, he's up been upgraded. My leaders now get really old. Got lots of boni, which is good because they level up. And then, you know, with more experience they are... Look at this skill, research speed plus 8. This one just also plus 8. For 4 stars and 5 stars plus 10. So 2% per level. I can have more leaders, I believe. Two more, but I don't have um, an admiral at the moment. A disruptor. Disruptors fire high energy balls that weaken and destroy the molecular bonds that hold the targets. Um, constituents atoms together. They are particularly effective against shields. New research. Maybe the particle lance? Or the ion disruptors. That's faster. Shield capacitor. That's for shield regeneration. That's also quite nice. I think I will go for the... Photon torpedoes. Proton torpedoes. It's eight months. That's fast enough. Of 
got the mega engineering, that's why I can um, construct the ring world. I've also got, you know, I need this um, special perk, the circle of life, which I did get because I did get an additional ascension perk thanks to the technology. Keep in mind that um, the traditions come with the patch 1.5, but the ascension perks, which you get one by actually completing one of the categories is uh, DLC only. Okay. Research complete. Research complete. Kinetic weapon damage plus five percent. That's really good because I've got kinetic weapons, advanced afterburners, maybe, or the advanced fighter wing. I think I'll go for the advanced fighter wing and bomber wing. Strikecraft attacks would also quite nice. Yeah, let's go for that. Only 18 months. Okay, now I upgrade the ships. I believe. No, not yet. Everything maxed out, even the uh, energy credits. So I should swiftly transform some, transfer some some credits because they can still stockpile stuff. Also, why not improve my fleet with, let's say. A big brother, a carrier, an enterprise, two cruiser, two cruiser, three destroyer, three stinger <coughs> class, and some more hunters. I will separate the hunters though. I should consider <coughs> building more. I'm sorry, I mess. I've got a sore throat a little bit. I still lost my voice a bit from the Kiss concert. Um, and they do have that spaceport thing, the observatory. They don't. Is it worth it by now? 10% slight boost. I think I'll do it. It'll cost some money, but that doesn't matter. Here it's not worth it. Worth it. Here it would be worth it, but I've got it already. On Electra Secundus, I have it as well. On Ember, I do have it. I do have it. I don't have it. It's, well, two points. It's not really worth it. But two points for one credit. I would build a research station as well. Um, yeah, so I'll do it. I think Research it's only complete. one. Yeah. Also increased sensor range, so not bad. I need to pause. The Rallis has got an observatory. They don't. And they can sure need a uh, deal with one or have one. Um, Epcravan definitely needs a an observatory. And that world also needs one for sure. Okay, I've got the proton torpedoes. Shield hit points plus five percent. That's an empire modifier. I don't have this particular thing. Um, field manipulation. I'll go for guardian point defense. I think. I've got a computer guy. That's also quite expensive. Maybe then, yeah, I'll do it. Because I've got some on some ships as well. There's the computer guy. He's been on one of the science ships, which is which are supporting research. And it's also good because you can then, uh, you know, switch around your guys. There we go. 
Let's speed things up a little. If I had 250 influence, I could also get another civics point. Construction complete. Yeah, that's the observatory, I guess. I don't have any particular research aims now. <clears throat> what I would like is... Construction complete. Yeah, that's all the research stuff. What I would like is more unity. So that I can get the other perk swifter. The um, galactic one that gives me three more mega structures. Inactive buildings, but well, that's no problem. Research complete. Research complete. That's the capacity booster. New research. I need to pause. Galactic stock exchange. That looks nice. By engaging in free trade of goods and uh, services, we allow for a more specialized economy, where an individual can excel in a narrow field and trade on on their needs. Costs 100 influence as well. It's one of the special buildings. Do I have a statecraft guy? No, I don't. Could I recruit one? No, I could not. So what I could do is use this guy. Because he's a, he's got a sentient AI assistant. And then I put the Voidcraft guy here. There we go. Maximize. Plus 50%, that's pretty cool. Now imagine if this guy with a sentient AI had upgraded had leveled up and uh, gotten, you know, something like Voidcraft or whatever for an additional 10%, would have been just mind blowing. He's gained a level. It's a shame I've lost. This, oh, this girl's more has dark matter. I've lost it because I've kind of lifted them up. Let me check. 24%, 24.8% of text they've got. Can I offer a trade deal? Not really. I have I had a research agreement in mind, but they get my research anyway, I think. They should also move to my system. You are unemployed, so move to my one of my places. Oh, they might steal that vortex. Why does this vortex not have dark matter? That's annoying. Research complete. Research complete. There we go. New research. I'll go for synth leaders. Allows synth pops to be leaders. That's pretty cool. But I would like to give them freedom. Building build speed. Auto cannon. Kinetic battery. Synth leaders. Is pretty awesome. I think I have a factory guy. 54 months and now it's just 51. Construction complete. Good. Service construction queue finished. Can use um, the great governor on a different planet now, maybe here. He's really amazing. Should give a nice boost to the research. Thank you. 
Schatten. Construction ship is nearly ready. But that's just the beginning. I can upgrade the ships. No, I can't. Have they been upgraded already? The carrier gunships? Yes, good. Thanks to auto upgrade. It does not only auto upgrade the design, but also the ships apparently. Well, 77% still some way to go actually. I've got so many credits, so many minerals. They just keep piling up. The dark matter here would be a massive, massive boost. 26.9%. How many planets could I colonize? One. Two. Three. Three, four. Need to pause. Four, five, six. I think I will allow this sector to colonize. Within sector borders. They should colonize um, this world. These worlds. They are decent planets. Invisibility, growth speed, lots of stuff. They've got a migration treaty, does not affect me. Unfortunately, this one doesn't have. Or well, could I maybe survey this? No. I could not. Okay, nearly ready, 99%. Unpause. Fantastic. We are now ready to begin the colossal, colossal task of building the initial frame of our future ring world around the primary star of the Sabic system. The amount of resources and materials required to build this skeletal frame will be immense, and hundreds of thousands of our finest engineers stand ready to begin the process of dismantling the system's planetary bodies into matter which can be used in construction. We are making history. Now th all this will disappear. Could be, I could have built lots of habitat stations around that as well. Toxic world, great. Okay, now what? Upgrade. Aha. I don't need a construction ship, apparently. This complex will serve as a staging ground resource depot and living quarters for the hundreds of thousands of pe personnel involved in the Ringsworld's construction. That's so amazing. 20,000 credits and many, many years. There we go. I get the impression that actually getting 
um, to the point where you can start building that is more challenging. So that's 10 years, I'm guessing, right? Um, it's more challenging than the actual construction itself with, you know, with the materials. Oh, what's that? A request from the Euthonian Accord. Engineers from the Euthonian Accord have been following the construction of our ring world from afar and are greatly impressed with our progress. They request our permission to station a team of engineers there to learn from our efforts. Because I'm a f This option is available due to Euthonian Accord having the phonetic materials. It would be an honor. Or deny the request. It would be an honor. Euthonian Accord, do I like them? Do they like me? Yeah, we like each other. They are kind of equivalent. But they won't join the Federation, unfortunately. It would be an honor. I will accept them. Hopefully they are not uh, terrorists or something. After spending several weeks on the ring world, the engineers from uh, Euthonian Accord have left. Despite the cultural differences, both teams were satisfied with the exchange and have learned much from each other. Engineering research gained 250. This is like half a month of, of research. This is not, <coughs> not really amazing, to be honest. So I did, lost, did lose count of the planet counting. I think it was something like four-ish. Then I will get one from here, eventually, and one from, you know, the, there. So it's like five or six, six maybe. So considering the victory conditions, six uh, would take me up to 37, but I need 58. So still like 21 missing. So no chance, actually. Galactic Stock Exchange, great new research. Clone Commanders, it's a rare technology, but not needed at all. Sector limit plus one not needed. Cheaper war demands not needed. I go for the rare one just because it's rare. Yeah, he can continue doing that. And it's also fast. I could actually build another ring world because there's nothing in this system. I think I'm actually going to do that. Build mega structure. Oh no, it's 300. I will have to wait a little bit. So move there. Okay, there's the ring world symbol. Research complete. Research complete. That's the Guardian Point defense. Ships are are being upgraded. I hope. What can I research? Shield capacitor sounds nice. Well, it's a computer guy. Maybe planet sensor range. I'll go for planet sensor range. And I do have the guy for that task. Now the interesting information about the science ships, for example, I do not get. And the interesting information would be, is a guy on board. They should could achieve that by simply, you know, highlighting the ship in a different color or something. Or making a small icon next to the ship, like a head or something. Okay, let's continue. Ten years is such a long time. And definitely not achievable in this episode. But I think I can start another ring world in this episode. I've already maxed out the food. I cannot uh, store more food. Already back to 25k. He's gained a level, nice. 
Construction complete. What construction would that be? Oh, the ships. Let me take a look at the habitats. Yes. Going well, unfortunately, no Pikachu on this one. If you look at the output, this is now a fully fledged habitat. I'm getting quite a bit of research, like, uh, like that's 34, 42, 50, uh, 52-ish, plus 29. So, in this case, also, it doesn't show the Unity output. It's a mistake. It should show the Unity output as well, which is an important, would have been an important information, I think. Let's speed things up. Incoming transmission. Trade deal offer. Yeah, you get that. I like you. Well, I could also, instead of building another ring world, reform my government. Leader skill levels plus one leader pool size not necessary. Unrest not necessary. I've got enough ma material ma minerals, so I don't need that. Cutthroat politics would give me influence. That's not bad. Corporate dominion. Empire energy generation. I've got enough. I've got farms also produce unity. That's interesting. Election influence. Mining guilds. Functional architecture, aristocratic elites. I think I'll go for the agrarian idyll. A simple and peaceful life can often be the most rewarding. This agrarian society has to a large extent managed to avoid large scale urbanization. Um, farms also provide one unity. Now that should be a massive boost. Five, six, three, I'll do that, 0.59. Um, and the rest I'll keep. 563 reform. 563 goes up to 712. I should have done that way earlier. That's pretty cool. The second ring world can wait. Look at this. This is crazy shit. Also, there won't be a second ring world. Obviously, there will be something else. Maybe. Leader lifespan increased, or the negative impact. Leader lifespan increased. That's pretty cool. Now it's 69 months waiting. I also need to open discovery to please one of the factions a bit. I think them, right? No born equal. Traditions of discovery. Research complete. Research complete. Clone commandos. The dick cost goes down. I think that's a good idea. And I think I will end this episode with this amazing boost in unity. So, thanks a lot for watching. Until then, bye for now.